The Greek mathematician Pythagoras discovered the intonation system we use today to play melodies and scales. His system provides us with the large whole steps and narrow half steps that lend expression to major and minor thirds and to leading tones. Here is the basic principle of that system. A Pythagorean whole step is constructed of two fifths on top of each other. In our example, this leads from an open D string to A and to E. If we take the E down one octave, we have a large whole step. The resulting E will be in tune as a fourth to the open A string, but it will be much too high to build a sixth as a double stop with the open G string. If we repeat the process from E to B to F sharp, we have another large whole step that provides a high major third in a D major scale. This high F sharp is not usable in a double stop with the open A string, but it sounds correct in the context of a scale or a melody. The printable sheet that comes with this explanation shows you how to build an entire D major scale in the Pythagorean system. When we practice intonation on melodies and scales, we can only compare perfect intervals to open strings, unisons, fourths, fifths and octaves. By definition, you cannot use thirds and sixths as double stops with open strings to check the accuracy of Pythagorean intonation. Thirds and sixths as double stops belong in the domain of just or pure intonation.